<laughs> that is paper. But it's a person on a paper. A picture of you. <laughs> I look great. Hey, I'm Josh Reimer, and I have been going to the gym, I'm sure you can tell. Not really, no. Well, I have been, and I've noticed an increase in the amount that I can lift. But just as I was starting to get impressed with myself, a video went viral on the web of a man lifting a car. What? Literally by himself, he grabs the back of a car and moves it aside. Take a look. Caramba, velho. How is that even possible? Either that is a really light car or that is a really muscular man. Mm. It was apparently shot in Sao Paulo, Brazil, and that man is apparently a real life Hulk because he just picked up that car like it ain't no big deal. He just gets off his bicycle, moves it aside, gets back on his bike, and heads on his merry way. Meanwhile, if I came across a bicycle blocking a path and I lifted that up and moved it, I'd probably look around waiting for praise and like kissing my biceps. That's just sad, Josh. I'm jealous. Actually, what might be my favorite part could be the guy who comes walking in near the end to help out by lifting the front of the car. Like, dude, no, okay? First of all, this is not something a normal body person is gonna do. So it's nice that you wanna help out, but you're just gonna look like a fool and possibly hurt yourself. Second, it's one thing to lift one side of a car and pivot it over, but to actually try to lift the entire car off the ground, no, no, just no. I understand your masculinity was probably threatened by what you were witnessing, but you're gonna have to just be be like me and stick to lifting bicycles because nobody can lift a car except this guy. I can. And, and him. It's nice that all the bystanders cheer for him in the video though, and it's also really nice that the guy shooting it decided to do the video horizontally, because often these kind of amateur last minute cell phone videos are shot vertically, which is super annoying, because you see like this much of the video, and then the rest is all just blackness. First world problems. Well, it, you might think this is just a first world problem, but this is an epidemic on YouTube, and it's something that I think Obama needs to focus on, okay? Because we've got like vertical videos, ISIS, me getting dual citizenship. Right. Because I need to live in Canada and the US. It's the platform I'm gonna run on when I run for president. You can't. Well, when I get my citizen dual citizenship. You still can't. You Don't ruin my dreams. Anyway, good for our muscular bicycling hero for being able to handle the situation like that with his bare hands and for inspiring me to go back to the gym again today because I clearly have a long way to go on my fitness. Clearly. But one day, mark my words, I will lift a car with these arms. <laughs> You're right. Maybe it won't happen. But what I can do is date somebody who can lift a car with his bare hands. And then problem solved. I'm a thinker. <sighs> now, how do you like me? Uh, probably a little bit less. Okay, well, thank you for watching this episode of The Sassy Scoop. Did you miss my previous two episodes? No, I was here. <laughs> okay, well, they might have, and if they did, they're right over there. Or there's links in the description below. And on Thursday, I'm gonna have a top 10 list where I talk about my preference in men. Oh, God, this should be good. So subscribe if you're new, because you don't want to miss it, and I'll see you then. Bye! Bye. <laughs> <laughs> that is a really muscular man, mm. or both. But apparently this was shot in San Paulo, Mexico, Brazil. <laughs> <laughs> Geography wasn't one of your strong suits, no, was it? No, it wasn't. No. Or that is a really muscular man. Yeah. <laughs> or both. It was apparently shot in Sao Paulo, Brazil. Sound it out. Sao <laughs> Paulo. <laughs> Bra Mexico. <laughs> Since it shows about this much of the screen, and then the rest is all just blackness. First word, but <laughs> Let me lie. Yeah, but